today we discuss the gating system gating system means all the passages through which molten metal enters the mold cavity so molten metal enters the mold cavity that means it includes the pouring cup sprue gate runner riser sprue base the manner in which molten metal enter the mold has a great impact on the quality of the casting produced so the gating system should be carefully designed and produced gating system should prevent the formation of oxide slag dross etc so now the elements of a gating system the first element for the gating system is pouring cup or pouring basin the main role of pouring basin molten metal is poured into a pouring basin which act as a reservoir from which it moves smoothly into the sprue and the pouring basin is also able to stop the slag from entering the mold cavity by means of a skimmer and this is the vertical portion that is known as the sprue and it is the channel through which molten metal is brought into the parting plane where it enters the runners and then gates and sprue are conical in shape because the molten metal when moving from top of the cup to the parting plane gains in velocity so requires a smaller area of cross section for the same amount of metal to flow at the bottom and the next part that is the sprue base well this is a reservoir for metal at the bottom of the sprue to reduce the momentum of the molten metal and the next part is runner it is generally located in the horizontal plane yeah, or parting plane which connects the sprue to its in gates and runner extension is provided to trap the slag in the molten metal the next part are these are the gate these are the opening through which molten metal enters the mold cavity so here is the mold cavity in which we produce the casting and from the gate the molten metal enters the mold cavity through the gate from the runner so here we can see molten metal that uh, starts to enter through the pouring cup then through the sprue and from the runner and through gates it goes to towards the mold cavity and the next part here as we can see uh, this is the riser most of the foundry alloy shrink during solidification so as a result of this volumetric shrinkage during solidification voids are likely to form in the casting so these voids needs the additional molten metal so hence a reservoir of molten metal is to be maintained from which metal can flow radially into the casting when the need arises and these reservoir are called riser and the main function of riser partially vacuum leads to a shrinkage void metal and their alloy shrink as they cool and solidify it creates a partially vacuum within the casting and riser promote the directional solidification a casting solidifying under the liquid metal pressure of riser is comparatively sound and another advantage of riser is a riser permit the escape of air and mold gases as the mold cavity is being filled with the molten metal so this is the detail about gating system and this is a gating system and all the components as we discussed pouring cup sprue sprue base well runner gate riser